right, so before you know it, monsoon. He's going to make it there. Maybe. Well, my best not to sneeze right now. That I was just going to ask you what's up with the sneeze meter because well, I, we're both I, I suffering. Think, I think I might have stacked it in the sequence. I'm not sure, but uh, my sneeze meter is off the charts right now. I think most of uh, the rest of the population is probably be, moderate yeah. right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, one thing we're going to see tonight for sure is uh, gorgeous sunsets in our skies. Sun will set tonight at 728. We are looking at uh, that explosion of uh, good colors, especially from Tucson points west in the Cochise County. Check it out. We're seeing uh, some not so good color, and that's courtesy of some clouds and yes, indeed some thunderstorms out there. All right, we are climbing up the charts today. Now 98 straight days without measurable uh, precipitation. Maybe not at your house, but remember, we keep these records at Tucson International Airport. That puts us at number seven. Should we go 16 more days, that would break the record. Hopefully we'll get some better monsoon moisture in here before that uh, happens. 105, so a hot day today of weather at Tucson International Airport. Seven degrees above average, kind of right in between the average high of 98 and the record of 112 set back in 1990. Glorious skies out there, a lot of blue. 101, the temperature at Tucson International Airport. West winds at 11 miles per hour. Dew point very low here in Tucson at 23 degrees, but it's awfully uh, sticky in sections uh, southeast of town. 102 foothills, 100 east side, 97 in Saurita. We're tracking temps into the low 90s in um, Sonoida. Check out Douglas, so 90, 84 in Portal, and that's courtesy of some of those showers and thunderstorms drifting on by. Here's a the trend then for tonight. Looks like 90s become 80s by 9 o'clock, and then upper 70s as we make our way into the early morning hours. Showers and thunderstorms starting to really wind down now across southeastern Arizona, but let's go on a quick Doppler tour, and you can see up towards Safford. Uh, these are fresh lightning strikes. Big story today, not really much in the way of rainmakers, but we are seeing some erratic winds and lightning strikes. This is what usually concerns us before the good moisture gets here, but indeed we have seen some reports of uh, rain falling on the ground, places like Douglas earlier today. And what's happening is we're tapping onto some outflow boundaries right here. Look at this monsoon alive and well across the entire Sierra Madre range in Mexico. That's one thing that can help our moisture out. Number two is uh, tropical storm now Aleta in the uh, eastern Pacific, well off the coast of Acapulco. National Hurricane Center in Miami does have it becoming a Category 1 hurricane, but it looks like that will be too far to really benefit us in any kind of rain. All right, lower 70s for lows, daytime highs tomorrow once again into the triple-digit territory. Uh, 105 on Friday, 105 Saturday. So we'll keep temperatures between 100 and 105 for the next seven days, lows in the 70s. And by Wednesday of next work week, maybe a 10% chance of showers. Paul Scala, before you know it, rain will be reaching the valleys of Tucson.